for some world championships. Matt oh, Campbell, back in December, average 95. Lost to Scott Waits. Now double 16. Oh, a great finish. Nice work, Matt Campbell. Matt, so not much pressure on this at 103. Matt had one. And Luke, no, he won't, but uh, he's thinking this is a good setup to visit, and it is. Well, he's taken out of 103, Campbell. So Luke Humphreys is back 24. for double four here for a hold of throw to go 3 2 up. Race to five. Double two. This is always problematic. And it was indeed for Luke Humphreys. Trouble 19, the first start, doesn't go. So, Luke Humphries is back for another stab. Yeah, the old double two thing here. He holds the throw. He gave an opportunity to Matt there, he didn't want to, but he... Matt. Last start for Luke Humphries, 3-2, he leads here. You do feel, John, that if... Luke can break oh, here. Be a big moment, but that's excellent from Matt Campbell. Now all about the pressure from Humphreys. Can't find a treble, not good enough, and he knows that. Treble 20 for double 14. Another high out. Yes. He's clicking in that department. This is really tense now, by the way. What a response from Luke Humphreys! Perfect timing! Needed that because he looked at a spot of bother on the throw here. Yeah, it's amazing to me that somebody with inconsistency delivering the dart has had four 180s in the short match. He needs a tops for a 120 out and he gets it! Where did it come from? 180, 120 out, 300 done in six times. This one's needed. Got to go now, or it could be all over if Humphreys can tidy it up here now. 44 needed, single 12. He's double 16 for the match, double eight. Could have been walking off stage now. Campbell to take us the distance. So at least it's not in the way that one, and that one won't be either. It's double 10. Is needed. Despondent. Double eight, the target. One for double. Double two! Yeah. Oh, Luke Humphries. Well, it was a real battle, that one. See plenty of Barney on the big stage. As it culminates in that world championship, and it ended for him a couple of years ago, so disappointingly. He didn't want to finish on that, that defeat to Darren Young. He gets his wish, he's back next month. Oh, that was the first round defeat, wasn't it? And so unlike Van Barneveld to go out with something like that, but he's down to 56 against the throw. So pressure on Joe Davis here. He wasn't happy. There's a lot of shoulder in that second that you can see. Fair play to him. Playing with a smile on his face. Unhappy when he lands a treble 20. That tells you something. Tops for Van Barneveld to break. Double 10. And does two up and listen to this crowd. Brooks, Nathan Rafferty, all still in the mix to be in the last 16. Great effort by all four of them, and still chances for them to progress. But Joe Davis, who had a poke on Barney's throw in the opening leg, a 51 139 is a big ass though. He started down the bottom. No, he's got the top, and he's just got to try and round it off and hope for some errors on the doubles. But. It's looking ominous for Joe Davis. Just pulls that right shoulder back. Right in the middle of the red bed. Tops it is. Raymond van Barneveld looking so relaxed and that rhythm that has taken him to the top time and time again. I can't wait for his match with Gary Anderson. That'll be fast and fiery. Yeah, he's in cruise control, Raymond, now. 
not very modest average, just above 91, but it's a, about getting the job done tonight. Raymond would have known it may not have been pretty, but get the win. Raymond Dumas, himself ready for his final match. Finish the job here, though. Let's see our first turn plus finish of the match. Double 14, but a 1 2 1. Yeah. Brilliant stuff from Raymond Van Barnevel. The 12 bar break of throw, and he now is one leg away. He's throwing for the match, and what will be a comprehensive victory about against Joe Davis, who's. Which it will be for the five time world champion, surely, the four time World Cup winner. Premier League, a couple of UK Opens. Can he give us a maximum? Yes, he can! Thank you, Raymond. Leaving 76. He's almost a little embarrassed about the fact that Joe Davis, I think, has. Hangs oh, the up there. He wins again. But Barney had a job to do. It's a good performance, actually. Just shy of 95 average and can finish it off here. He had a 12 dart in the previous leg. He can cap it off here with a 15 dart and it'd be a good night's work for Raymond Van Barnevel. Tops, yes. yes. Straight in the middle again. The pro tour, she's enjoyed some good wins, hasn't she, Laura? Michael Smith, Van Der Voort, Adrian Lewis, Steve Lennon have all fallen to Lisa Ashton. So One run on, there's, been, there's been highlights over the period of those two years, haven't there? Two seasons. There has, there has. But like anything, naturally all attention is drawn when it comes to a TV event and she got her maiden One televised win back at the UK seven. Open uh, against uh, Aaron Beanie. Posted a ton plus average in that one as well. So, well, needs the treble just underneath that and finds it to leave the bullseye. Oh, oh sorry, 97. Do I require 80? Well, that rattled the John Henderson cage. The Scotsman needs another single for the double. And there it is. Nice finish. But he's got a chance now to go three up here. Looking to leave double 18 there, couldn't do so. 53. Can leave tops when he returns, if he returns, unless Lee Strashton's got a real roof raiser here. One run on 20th. Over there for Lisa on the 18th, so tops required though for Henderson. Well, it was double 10 last time in hand in the first leg, and it is in the third leg also. Something special for Lisa to uh, claw her way back into the match. Could it be the big fish? Seventy-six. Only require one hundred and four. Slip into the one means he couldn't finish on this throw. So Lisa will be back for a holder throw for ninety-four. Took the safer route of the bullseye or 25. And that leaves the bullseye. She's had one go at it tonight. And this time she's hit it seven attempts. And Lisa Ashton gets her first leg on the board in the 2021 Grand Slam of Guards. For the bullseye. Needs the treble to make this interesting, really. Well, that Jordan doesn't look enough. Does leave a finish just about as Hendo looks at treble 19 for double. No, he goes the ball route as well. 20 for ball now for Big John. He's just thinking about it, isn't he? 55. Well, Lisa turns down the dart of the bullseye. Doesn't believe that Lisa Ashton will take out 160. And if that's what he believed, he was right. And I will say, as a player, sometimes when someone does that, you really want to hit it even more than normal. <laughs> Double ten has been his friend tonight. 
Hits it for the third time in the match to give himself a three-leg lead. She will need four on the trot, as we've mentioned. Well, it's a possible 12 dart leg for Lisa Ashton here. There's options here. For 13 for double 16. 17. Now then, what a way to finish a darts match. On the bullseye with a 1 6 1 out shot. And that's how close it was. To finishing with style. Double eight. Absolutely spot on there from Lisa Ashton. And that certainly could be the beginning of the end here. Henderson, half a dozen darts at 144. It will need some sloppy stuff from the Scot to give Ashton a look in here. Well, that was something sloppy. But he still leaves 89 when he comes back. And Ashton again, uh, Laura, as you made the point, needs two trebles. John, you require 89. before John Henderson, nine darts from 89. For the match, then. That's the target, and that's the dart, and that is the dart. That's a fantastic player, we know that. She's at it again here. Fill it up, Fallon! Oh, yes! We said we going to want to make it up from yesterday. The crowd are about to hold 54. their breath. Fallon requires <laughs> 140. Now go and win the leg, Fallon. That's the priority. So that every time you get deep towards a nine data the priority forget about it go and win the leg mm, you saw her just take a step back gave herself a bit of a talk into but unfortunately just went out the uh, treble 10 into the treble 15 but it's key as well it's against the throw laura short wow. format and all that yeah it's massive it's massive so double eight and just adjusting Absolutely no problem. Well, that's a fantastic finish, isn't it? To go for it. No. Back for 31. That could be a sign of how good she's feeling up there. Six. Super confident, yeah. Fallon Absolutely. Require 31 for Fallon Cherrick now. For a 3 0 lead. Double 14. Game no show, no problem. problem. No messing Fallon around. Sherrick. Brilliant dance from Fallon Cherrick. 3 0 up. Game up. His form has slipped, but Sherrick's just not missing. She's in the zone. Wow, Absolutely in the zone. 14. Averaging 113, Fallon Sherrick. We know what a huge moment it was for her last night to be back on the big stage. Fallon, you require 81. She looks very calm. Double 18. Now double nine for 4 0. Plenty of time here. Oh. On the oh, there was me thinking, Good don't go like to the inside. Wrong travel. Mike Decker must have been shock here. Alan, you require 157. Down to 88. If Fallon doesn't go out of here, can't quite get the treble 19. All about the setup from here now to put the pressure 97. on Mike the Decker. Brilliant, 18. brilliant. To stay on the stage. He's double seven, De Decker. Is that the last down he throws tonight? Six 60 needed for Fallon Sherrick. 19 for tops. 
tops needed for the match. 25. Did she Mike just snatch at that? I wonder. Big moment, Laura. Yeah, it was a big moment for her, and you could see the frustration. No but he's bust. He's bust the screen. How many require 35? Trevor three. Mike. There's the three. Needs double 16. Game. Successfully, you, you feel better doing that. One follows the other. 98. So, Sulevich with a chance to break back. It's on. He gets a dart. And that is a great finish from Mensa Sulevich. So, we could have three breaks. 100. As you recall, 131. We saw 106 taken out. 131 will be even better. Yeah, the wrong treble, though. 55. Does he require so, 80? De Souza. And again. Oh, and yes, it's chosen. In fabulous fashion. Come on, then. Too careful at the odd time. Both of them have been such determined figures on the circuit. A lot of soft tip darts as well back in the day for both Sulevich and De Souza. That's excellent. From the special one there. Can Sulevich hold the 101? So, a dart, a double 16 for a hold, and it's the second successive hold. And that will give Sulevich some confidence because it's two. This is extraordinary, really. From two fabulous players. 25. 65. Well, he's just checking where he is. Jose is down to 76. Sulevich a mile away. Yeah. There's times when this game could feel easy, and this isn't one of them. <laughs> no, it certainly isn't. Nine and it's not nine. enough for Mensa. It so it's in Jose's hands for another break and a victory. There's a lovely treble 20 and a double eight to finish. It's easy. It's easy this game in the end. Match play final where he, I think he was 9-0 down. He just couldn't do anything right for the, the first half hour of that match. And then was probably the... Is he getting it? No. Then was probably the best player for the next 10 legs. So, so for a level game, tops, tops. 60. Michael, you require 40. You mentioned tops, the target again for Michael Smith. But now he has to hunt double five and he, he finds it. on the second leg, Michael Smith. Six. Important this for Anderson. Tops then. 26. And you're not Michael killing with the importance there, Rodri, because if this goes in, Anderson, he's bang under he's it, and line. he is bang Michael under it, Smith. within the blink of an eye. The copious amounts of big trebles, there's just that wayward dart every now and again. You mentioned control, maybe. Control is just that little bit more, but he's back in this game. Even so, Michael Smith here with a chance to get another break and go 4-2. Should all things being equal get a dart at least at bullseye. 12. Gets the treble, double 13. 50. And that's how close he was to 4. Gary, you require 100. Yeah, you could tell by Michael Smith's face there, that was a bit of a push stroke. Pull at the end. In off. 80. I'm not sure what happened. Michael, I don't know if he got 26. Hit the flight on the way through. That was just. No. Awkward. He's on the sick leg. Nine in the previous leg. Now he's left one, two, four after nine. 
If it's 15, 60. 140s like in this match, and two 180s, they're only in the seventh leg. 84. This is what Smith can do to you, Rod. He does it so quickly, especially when you're a speedster yourself. He's scoring Easy very, zero. very heavily here, isn't he? Michael Lee McGuire, 40. And he wants double top to put the tin lid on this darts match, yeah. and he does. And that's a very, and very a good win by Michael, Michael Smith. Smith. 19, you probably won't see the ball come into play here. There we treble 10. No need for 12 ball. Can take his time. Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. Four Set up the shot, Clemens. Back on 179. It should be our first holder throw of the match. And yeah, that was professional from Peter Wright. Because whatever Clemens does here, and it, you know he's going to get a big score. He just had to. It's three and a double 16 for the world number two. Has missed three clean at double already. Over to double eight now, Peter Wright. And he convert here, last start. And he misses oh, three yeah. again. Well, Got swings and roundabouts oh. in this, and suddenly, for a break, Clemens yeah, hits Tops. Gabriel Clemens. You can't predict this. Gabriel, 161 sets to three. It's just over the best of nine legs. But he's going to level up here. 89. Because Peter Wright's in the 300s, and it's not often you see that. Peter Wright, only maximum leaves a finish, so comfortable leg it should be for Clemens, but 57. it should have been a comfortable really leg like one. The previous leg, having four darts at a double. Another one of them for tops, for three apiece. Just checking, sensibly. Yeah, and delivers. Gabriel. And the fist pump from the German the giant. Starts the flights, everything. It's his way, and who are we to criticise? No, you can't, as I said. I think he's Ooh, not appreciated enough. 65. Gabriel Clements is really producing a fantastic eighth leg here, under pressure. Peter Wright, a maximum. No, 140. 140 leaves. Gabriel well, a threat, 16. But three darts at double eight. Got to convert. Yeah, and there's convert. The Four apiece, and now they're holding throw. Still, this crucial leg, and Gabriel Clements bangs in two treble twenties and a third. Big leg, and if he shots in, he's definitely through, isn't he, Mark? Well, I said it doesn't guarantee. It would guarantee Peter right through. I could still get Gabriel Clemens oh, wouldn't be guaranteed going through. Just gonna get ourselves short, but he. And one foot in that last 16, and what? I think it's Turn almost two feet in the last 16. Gabriel Clements matched up, misses. 13. Oh, the drama here in Wolverhampton. And Peter 48. Wright now has the chance. Two darts, one fat 16, one double, and it will be a 5 4 victory, and he'll breathe a sigh of relief. Double eight. One dart in hand. And he misses. And the crowd, his fans, can't believe it. And is it going to be a repeat? Is it going to be Gabriel Clemens taking out Peter Wright on this night? Well, actually, won 7-4 in legs. He should have won that World Championship game. And maybe if he had, he would be calling it a rivalry. As he fires in the maxi, as Mark Webster said, he hit 19 in that World Championship game. He then missed a couple of match starts at the bullseye before losing the sudden death leg by four sets to 64. three in an Ali Pali Classic. Double 16. 48. Michael Aguirre. Would have been a dozen dart leg opener yeah. for Joe Cullen. Staying there. Double nine. Yeah. That is double nine. That's a one three eight. Joe Cullen misses a dart a double 16 for a 12 dart leg with the darts and doesn't come back. This match. Ninety-three. Like we won and 12. 
60. He's looking to set it up, and that's what he's done. But I expect Joe to get this now. 16. Well, the first half was a perfect marker. Got to go, Rodri. Double eight then for the Dutchman. 24. Rush. They were rushed. Well, they were, but there's no earthly yeah, reason why he'd be rushing. He's, 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 he couldn't be in a better position than after the three legs would be three up. So. Well, this is... This is ludicrous. Ooh, <laughs> Joe Cullen has to take out this one, three, two. Michael Van Gerwen's on 16 after just nine darts. 104. Michael, you require 16. And that's his best leg of the match, and the best of the tournament, in point of fact. Thrown all around the stage by this Dutch hurricane. Yeah. And yet has stood up and played through oh, it. And when, when the odd chance has arrived, he's taken it. Yeah. And he's still in this darts match because he has to throw in this leg, and he would have it also in the final leg if he can somehow get back to four each. He's hit four maximums. 140. So is Van Gerwen, by the way. There's nine maximums in the previous game. There's already been eight in this, seven, only yeah. in the seventh leg. Oh, wow. Now he's on 58 after nine. This one four, seven has to go, Joe. Four, a five-two win. Wants 58, now tops. Yeah, that is and a man. fire to win. Watch an incredible performance from Michael Van Gerwen.